outspoken retired Supreme Court Justice Professor George Kanye Hamba has tied the onitsis nest, alleging that there could be a conspiracy to block a probe into corrupt judges. Speaking during the annual dinner organized by the Makere University Law Students Association at Serena Conference Center, Kanye Hamba said he handed a list of corrupt judges and lawyers to the Chief Justice, but no action has been taken. We were not satisfied with how the Chief Justice dealt with the complaints of corruption, misbehavior, conduct in the office. He claimed that instead of setting up a probe, the names were leaked to those accused of taking bribes. I was shattered about this. I said the, the, this report was supposed to be, to be confidential, strictly confidential. How could it have been leaked? Throwing up pent-up frustration, the former Attorney General and Lord Dawn wondered why a commission of inquiry has never been sanctioned. According to Article 147, sub Article 1, Part D of the Constitution, the Judicial Service Commission, among other duties, is mandated to receive and process people's recommendations and complaints concerning the judiciary and the administration of justice. However, Kanye Hamba accuses the Judicial Service Commission of taking no action, yet there is glaring evidence against many judicial officers. We have written so many letters complaining, but we never get answers. This is one thing, Mr. President, you must go. Whether you agree with the complaint or not, surely you owe it to your members to respond to their complaints. Arias Chisauzi, the judicial spokesperson, says Kanye Hamba forwarded some names, but his allegations are not backed by cogent evidence. His complaint was then approved by the Chief Justice. And he referred the matter to the, the, the disciplinary committee, and the disciplinary committee found no sufficient evidence to warrant this, uh, to warrant the matter be either uh, referred to the Judicial Service Commission or to be investigated further. He is also not sure how Kanye Hamba's confidential dossier leaked. Kanye Hamba employed law students to upon graduation practice law with high ethical and moral standards. We are victims of silent fear. People say they will deal with us or they will punish us. But this Kanyihamba you see here has been writing ever since he was a judge. Openly. Reports have emerged in the past that there is graft, especially in the magistrate courts, where graft has seeped through the hallowed grounds of temples of justice. Kanye Hamba also criticized the Deputy Chief Justice Stephen Kavma's recent interim order banning activities of the FDC party. Now I've been asking myself, is defiance an offense under our law? Is it defined in the Constitution? Is it defined in our penal code? If somebody is aggrieved, other than containing for one reason or the other, it was done or it was uh, uh, actuated by this and this. So it is the, 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 the process of how you overturn a decision of the court. The function was attended by Court of Appeal Justice Godfrey Chiriabwiri, the former Uganda Law Society President Ruth Sebatindira, her successor Francis Gimara, and the Lord Mayor Elias Lukwago. Solomon Kawesa, NTV. No.